We're hearing from some people in eastern North Carolina about safety concerns at large outdoor parties. A Halifax County party over the weekend ended in a mass shooting that left one woman dead. WRL's Keenan Willard shows us the debate between promoters and partygoers over whether these events should have enough security. The Halifax Sheriff's Office says it's not planning to cite any of the people who hosted that party where six people were shot over the weekend. Today, some promoters in eastern North Carolina are distancing themselves from that event. It's just very sad, like, and it's sad that innocent people had to get shot and a mother lost her life and her child has to go on without her. A bonfire party ended in gunshots in Halifax County over the weekend. The Halifax Sheriff's Office says six people were shot at the Double D Ranch. 25-year-old Sierra Webb died from her injuries. Ranch owner Dennis Harvey says security teams stopped 27 guns from getting into the party. The Halifax Sheriff's Office says shell casings show gunshots were fired inside and outside of the event. And some attendees say promoters needed to do more to keep people safe. I feel like security should have been a little bit more tighter. Maybe this incident would have been, you know, wouldn't happen like it's a sad, tragic incident. Yesterday, the Halifax Sheriff's Office told WRL that the promoters of the party near Enfield also threw an event at a Rocky Mount restaurant last month, where police say a fight broke out and a person was stabbed. Today, three of the Rocky Mount promoters tell WRL they were not affiliated with the party in Halifax County. I watched the surveillance cameras. I was here and it didn't happen. We did our part. The police came and got all the footage here and, you know, we still haven't heard anything else about it. The Halifax Sheriff's Office says there's no law against having large parties on private land. And unless they receive a noise complaint, they won't break up an event. Some who were at the Halifax party say these parties need to be shut down until gun violence can be controlled. And one of my other friends, she was like, it's like the gunshot came like by her ear. It was so terrifying. She was like, she thought it was never going to end. WRL reached out to promoter Jacquez Davis, who DJs under the name Hucklebuck, asking for a response to safety concerns. He declined to comment, but posted a statement to Facebook on Sunday, saying, I myself want to apologize to the people in the mix of guns being shot. He says our security was on point at the gate with searching, but once you get to your car, we can't control all them people. Keenan Willard, WRL News.